This episode of Photonics Hot List is sponsored by Kyocera, where the future is what we create. I'm Justine Murphy, Senior Editor of Laser Focus World, with a peek into what's happening in the exciting world of photonics. Forget dyes and labels, a new imaging technique can resolve nanostructures smaller than the diffraction limit of light without them. The new method, developed by researchers from the University of Graz in Austria, is essentially a modification of laser scanning microscopy, a way of illuminating a sample using a strongly focused laser beam. In their work, the team measured the light's intensity upon its interaction with a specimen and could also detect other parameters encrypted within the light field. Specifically, they were able to measure the position and varied sizes of gold nanoparticles at an accuracy of just a few nanometers. This approach to laser scanning microscopy could become the preferred method for imaging nanostructures as it's completely non-invasive. There is no need to prepare and inject fluorescent dyes into a specimen prior to imaging. A new self-cleaning optical fiber could mean big things for bio and environmental applications. Developed by researchers at Tampere University in Finland, the multimodal optical fiber features a parabolic refractive index profile that boasts high nonlinearity as well as transmission and power beyond the limitations of conventional optical fibers. By injecting short pulses of light into the fiber, the team vastly broadened into the mid-infrared. Variation in the refractive index causes occasional focusing and defocusing of the light inside the fiber, which allows coupling between spatial and temporal nonlinear light matter interactions. This prompts a self-cleaning mechanism that creates super continuum light with very high power and a clean, smooth beam. The work demonstrates for the first time the generation of two octave supercontinuum light in a non-silica graded index fiber. The researchers say the new optical fiber could be used for things like cancer diagnostics and identifying and monitoring environmental pollutants. Physicists in California have found that a hydrogen molecule could serve as a quantum sensor prompting unprecedented time and spatial resolution for monitoring and measuring a material's chemical properties. The team, based at the University of California, Irvine, demonstrated the technique in a scanning tunneling microscope equipped with a terahertz laser. The work involved positioning two bound hydrogen atoms between the microscope's silver tip and a flat copper surface sample covered with tiny pieces of copper nitride. Laser light pulses lasting just trillionths of a second could excite a hydrogen molecule and allow detection of changes in its quantum state at cryogenic temperatures. This produced atomic scale time-lapsed images of the sample. The researchers say this work paves the way for further development of devices such as quantum microscopes, which have already proved to be more sensitive than traditional technologies. The new technique could also push advancement of things like energy systems, electronics, and quantum computers. And that's your Photonics Hot List. For more information, visit laserfocusworld.com. Thanks for watching.